welcome everyone. My name is Ayn and it's time to journey into the witch book speculations. Why is this speculation? Because they post on their Twitter and the accompany image that makes me wonder if witch book news is coming soon, maybe even a launch date. And as always, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoy my content. Also, this is all speculation. Chucklefish has not confirmed any news other than a new image from Witchbrook that was released. So let's review what we know about the game before moving to the Twitter post that started the speculation path. The official logo for Witchbrook. One of the images that has been released before. Another image that has been released before. The last image that has been released before. For more information on Witchbrook, I have done a video previously on this game. The link will be in the upper right hand corner. I will go over the events in the order that they were posted and backtrack to prove some of the things I think that are really stands out to where it's pointing to which book news and hopefully a release date in the future. The first Twitter post by Chucklefish was on June 17th showing the three jobs listings along with the image from Witchbrook, followed by another post by Chucklefish celebrating 10 years old on June the 10th with this image that I originally thought was from Witchbrook before it was confirmed that it was Witchbrook. And then on June the 15th, the job listings are still listed along with the new image that was confirmed to be Witchbrook. These three Twitter posts is what has really got my mind wrapped around the possibility that Witchbrook news is coming and that it could be a release date soon. Now between those two posts at the end of my previous uh, showcasing of Twitter posts. This one was part of the, you know, 10th anniversary of Chucklefish. And it states also Cheeky Witchbrook Gift. It was like the floor dropped below me because how did this information come about? Why is it attached to the 10th anniversary? And why did they post these listings? You know, you know, on Twitter, that's where they posted it. You know, they're asking for new people. And who are they trying to speak to? And of course, the most important information that we want to know is when will it be released? There goes my attempt at a timeline. My excitement for this IP is, I think, just too much for me to contain and to put into a box. It just needs to go all over the place because it's just it's so exciting. Witchbrook news and possibly it's being released soon. The one thing that I really want to know is, was this intentional or was this a accident that happened and that was leaked? Uh, that's something that we may never know. And I can't believe I haven't shown you guys the new GIF from Witchbrook. So here it is on your screen. It appears to be a, you know, a meadow with a little lake. Uh, there's a squirrel, clearly. It's a forest area. Uh, is this part of a cutscene? Is this, you know, an area you can visit? We don't have that information but I'm hoping that they'll give us more information on this and just not leave us here hanging with just a gif only compared to like the other images. Well, no, they did that with the other images. So what am I talking about? They'll tell us when they're ready to. 
Now let me return back to my script that I had written out for this video and I like to point out two key jobs that were you know interesting to me that were posted along with the Witchbrook image which is the marketing artist and the temp community manager. First, for the marketing artist, you need an artist to market your new IP. It's a brand new game that requires new promotional items to appeal to your targeted demographic, a fresh pair of eyes to push content for this labor of love. Plus, they help publish and market other indie games. They could be low in human resources to fill in for a new IP from their company. Marketing can take months of planning and the artist will need time to create these images. Second, why are they seeking a temp community manager? Is it to help with the influx of new community members because of a highly anticipated new IP from Chucklefish? Once the game's release date is publicly known, the community will grow and new members will join because of a new magical life sim to play. Chucklefish has a proven track record with all its games and it will show in the community's growth and they will need additional help until it's out for everyone to play. I have saved the most significant piece of evidence that is not on Twitter or anything I have shown in my video so far. And this is regarding Witchbrook's release date information coming soon. Now, remember, Chucklefish team pitched two game ideas after the success of Starbound. The first idea became Wargrove, and the other one was Witchbrook. Wargrove is a strategy game released on February 1st, 2019. Starbound released on July 22nd, 2016. So they round up about three and a half years between original IP releases. So next year would mark three years since Wargrove was released and therefore Witchbrook may release next year. Hopefully we'll know soon after these jobs listings are filled. Do you agree, disagree, or have your own speculations to share? Post your comments below. Please remember to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video and want to see more Witchbrook news from me. Thanks for watching and I can't wait to see you guys on our next journey.